Okay, here out there. Welcome, welcome. It's your man, Jai, a.k.a. Flip. And welcome to another Get Fit with Flip workout video. First of all, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who shouted me out and wished me a happy birthday on this past Saturday. I had a wonderful birthday. I got a lot of surprises. I got food catered to the house. I got um, an edible arrangement that came to the house. I got a homemade cake and the whole nine yards. So I really, really appreciate everybody shouting me out. Uh, but guess what? Now that's past, I got to work all that off because I did, did overindulge as you should do on your birthday and enjoy myself. But now it's time, it's Monday. It's time to get back into the grind. So that's what we're going to do today. I got to get my workout card. So, and move my hand. So, it's Monday. That's right. We're going to get right into the grind. Everybody take your work break. Or if you're working from home, take your break. If you're not working from home and you're just chilling and enjoying it on the video, please come on, come on, come on. Join me for this workout today. So we're going to start out with a little bit of stretching exercises first. As you see, I got my knee pad on. This right knee will just not act right. So I got to stretch my knee out a little bit, but it's a good exercise for you as well. So in order to stretch your knee out, what I want you to do, take your legs, place them together like this, and you're just going to do small circles. Small circles to the right. Rotate to the right first. Real small circles. Oh. And then now we're going to reverse and go the other way to the left. Small, small circles. This warms the knees up. Really gets a good stretch, all right? Now what I want you to do next is put your feet together, but you're going to be like at a tiny feet at an angle like this. I just want you to press Take your hands on the inside of your knees and just press out. And then you're going to press in. And your knees touch. Put those feet together. Out. In. One more. Out. In. All right, good job. Stand up straight. Now, let's uh, get those shoulders warmed up as well. So, take your arms, place them out to your side. Just a small forward rotating circles. Gotta get the bones warmed up. The bones have got to be warm. All right, then we're gonna go reverse. Small circles. All right, then we're gonna go forward. Big circles. Really get those shoulders warmed up. All right, then we're gonna go reverse. Big circles. All right, then place our hands up over our head. We're going to do some circles. Going inward. Reverse. Going outward. All right, drop your arms up to your sides. Wave your hands around like you just don't care. All right, take this arm. Place it across your right shoulder. Take the other hand. Press into your, uh, your back of your elbow. Hope everybody had a good weekend. On the side, I told you my great weekend was great. I really, really overindulged. I loved it. Loved it. I had to get the cake out of my house, y'all. So I'm gonna have to get, figure out a way to get rid of the cake because if it sits there in my kitchen, it's gonna be cold and maggy. Up over your head, then you're gonna take your arms, interlock your fingers behind you, and just stretch back. All right, good job, everybody. Grab a little bit of water. Let me just grab some right here. Hi, Miss Debbie King and Stephen Jackson. Hello, guys. How you doing? Grab some water. All right. Put this back up here. Excuse me. So, today, I hope you saw, four water bottles are needed for today's workout. All right? At some point in time doing this workout, we're going to use using four water bottles. All right. So, what we're going to start out with, we're going to start out with our jumping jacks with our water bottles. We're gonna do some shoulder raises with our water bottles. Then we're gonna do some squats with bicep curls in the water bottles. Like always, I don't assume anybody knows, so I wanna demonstrate each exercise to you. So, simple, two water bottles right by your side. We'll back up a little bit. And we're just gonna do jumping jacks. We'll look like this. We'll do 10 jumping jacks. 
Then also what we're going to do is we're going to do our shoulder raises. So for shoulder raises, what I want you to do today, I want you to take your bottles, hold them down to your side. You're going you're gonna to come up, come up like this, and go down. Up, down, just like this. Really overemphasize when you come up at the top. So those will be out. It works right back here. It works your shoulders and it works uh, um, also your lats. So, you know what? I'm going to change exercise for the day for the shoulder range. We've done those before. Let's do this. I like this one better. Let's try this one today. Those are out shoulder raises for your lats. So instead of going up, we're going to do like this. Hold your bottles right here in front of you. You go out to your side. All right? And then our last exercise for this set is we're going to do squats with bicep curls. So what it's going to look like is you're going to start, this is your starting position, all right? As you do a squat, the bottles will come down to your side, and as you're coming up, they'll come down. So just like this, down, up, down, up. Hey, listen, if you can't go down all the way to a squat, you go as far as you can because on my bad knee, I may only go this far. I may not be able to go out to a full squat. All right, so. Our exercise is 10 water bottle jumping jacks. Then we're going to do our 10 shoulder raises. And then we're going to do 10 squats with bicep curls. All right, everybody got it? Grab a glass of water. We are going to do three rounds. And we'll, do, we'll have a 10 second rest in between each, uh, each round. All right? So, everybody's ready? You got to grab your water bottles. On my count, three, two, one, let's have some fun. All right, go right into those. One, two, three, almost like a chicken. Okay, flying away. Six, seven, Eight, two more. Nine, one more, 10. All right, remember starting positions, let's go. Three, two, one, let's have some fun. One, two, like I said, squat down as far as you can. When you come up, really squeeze with that water bottle. Even though it may not be heavy or a lot, all about the uh, technique. Seven, inhale going down. Eight, nine, ten. Good job, everybody. All right, so that's good. That's our first set. All right, five, four, three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Let's get that second set in. Let's go. Good job. Let's get those shoulder raises. Oh my God, the food I had this weekend, y'all, was so good. I had two cakes for my birthday. Not one, but two cakes. That's right. So you know I'm trying to get some work in. Okay. It's eight. I think I lost count. I'm always talking. Nine. That's all right. Ten. All right. Ready? Right here. Three, two, one. That's so fun. Yeah, I really taste the difference. Catering company, right here, out here in the Amla area. Good friend of ours. Some good food, Some mushrooms, salmon. Eat this salad. Really appreciate everything. My wife really gave me a good, good birthday. You should feel a little burning in your biceps now from doing those. If you're doing those nice and squeezing at the top, you should feel a bicep. All right, this is our last set of these. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Good job. All right, last set of these. Five, 
six, seven, three more, eight, two more, nine, and ten. All right, this last set for those squats, the bicep curls, three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Inhale, exhale. Trying to get some of my sickle cell warriors to join me doing it. Can't do all the exercises, but you can probably do some of them. Gotta keep moving, you know what I'm saying? Want that body to get stiff, especially after you had a crisis. All right, good job, everybody. So, we did our jumping jacks, our shoulder lat shoulder raises. And we did our bicep curls. So grab some water right quick. I'm going to run down the next set of exercises for you, all right? So our next set, we're doing a little moving. This one, you're going to need those four water bottles. So what I want you to do is take two water bottles, place them to one side, and then you're going to take the two other water bottles, like I have here, and you're going to place them to the other side of you. And give yourself about, I don't know, about six inches in between yourself so what he's going to do is we're going to do a quarter turn and we're going to do two bent up two bent over rolls so it's going to be a couple a couple of movements going on here at the same time so what it's going to look like is this my bottles over a little bit you're going to do a quarter turn bend down pick up your water bottles do two bent over rows place them back down come up come back to the front to the other side bend down Come back to the front, bend down and do it again. So we're gonna do, I'm pumping up today. I got to pay for me eating all that, that cake this weekend. We're gonna do five. So every time I come in after five means we're gonna do one set to each side for a total of five. So those are quarter turns with bent over rows, all right? Then after that, we're gonna do side lunges. So what you'll do with your side lunge, take your two water bottles, I'll hold you. Two of your water bottles, shoulder width apart, and all you're gonna do is take it, do a lunge. You're gonna lean to either the right or the left side, doesn't matter which way you start. It's gonna look like this. So you're gonna go take a small step, come up, pull the other way, come up. Small step, come up, get that squat, bring your feet together, go to the other side, come up, all right? So we're gonna do 10 of those, five to each side. And then we're going to finish up with standing pec flies. This is good for your, your chest and your pecs. What that looks like is this. Take the two water bottles right out in front of you. Go back. And when you come in, I want you to really concentrate on squeezing right here in the middle of your chest. So, so I kind of over, over exaggerate going back. We're going to get it like this. Okay. So, on those quarter turns, if you can't jump, you don't have to jump. All you got to do is just turn. Turn, do your two, turn back, turn the other way, do your two. I know everybody can't jump because they may have bad knees or some other issues going on, or you don't want to jump. It doesn't make a difference to me. As long as you do it, turn, get out. All right, so we're going to start out with our quarter turns. I'll count. I'll let you know when we're done. Right after that, we're going to our side lunges. And then after that, we're going to go into our peg flies, all right? So, everybody got your water situated. Two on this side, two on this side. Ready to go, let's go. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Bend over row. Nice and slow. Really over at the side, pull with that back. Jump nice and soft. Nice and fluid. Take your time, go at your own pace. One more. Those legs should be burning. Good job, everybody. All right, I'm gonna grab two of those water bottles, set the other two aside. 
We'll go right into our side lunges. Feet shoulder width apart. I'm going to the left, which will be your right. That's to make a difference. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Feet together. Other side. See, I'm holding those water bottles on each side of my leg. Adds a little resistance. You don't have to do them with water bottles if you don't want. One more. Good job. All right. Now we'll go right to our peck flies. Follow straight out in front. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Hello, everybody. So our third one. Really, when you come together, squeeze. Work to the outer and inner chest. I think we got three more. I always lose count when I start talking. And one more. Good job, everybody. All right, put those bottles back down. Get them situated out to your side. Along my count, jump to, the jump to the left or jump to the right. Doesn't make a difference. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Remember, you don't have to jump. You can step. You don't have to jump. If you don't want to, you just step like this. Of course, your man ain't gonna jump. In the middle, rise up. The heart should be racing. One more, y'all. Good job. All right, we have those water bottles. Remember, side lunges, five to each side. On my count, three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Squat out. Go as far as you can on your lunge. You don't have to go all the way down. Go quarter away. Then way as long as you're doing a lunge. I told you I got bad knees, so I know I can't go down as far as I used to when I was a youngin. All right, good job. Water balls out in front. Hello, everybody. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. I'm getting cabin fever, y'all. I can tell you that now. That's why I love working out side on Friday when it was nice. And I'm got a little ADHD, so I can never sit still for long periods of time. So, what we gonna do? What we gotta do, right? We got to obey the law. All right. So last set. Get the water bottle. Set them up. Set them up. Set them up. Set them up. All right. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. We've been over rows. Come up. Like doing those. Hopefully your heart is racing like mine should. Mine is. Alright. Ready? Side lunges. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Take it out to the side. 
I had to step over my bottles. Almost had an accident. One more. All right, good job. One more set. Peck flies. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Inhale, exhale. It's three, four, five, six, seven, three more, eight, two more, nine, and ten. Good job, everybody. So, we've done two rotations so far. Hope your heart is racing a little bit. Now we've got to get down on the ground and do a little work, all right? Let me grab me some water. Two's on. Gabban, what's up, dude? What's up, Mr. Brown? How are you, sir? All right, so now, uh, everybody excuse me. About to do a little ground and pound work, all right? So, to finish out, we're gonna do one of my favorite Marine Corps exercises of all time, mountain climbers, and I lie. We're gonna do mountain climbers with bottle raises, sit-ups with bottle punches, and then we're gonna work our obliques, all right? So this is all really a lot, of, actually a lot of ab and core work, because mountain climbers do work your core. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one water bottle, push all the other ones to the side, you don't need it right now, all right? You're gonna get down in the plank position, what I want you to do is you're gonna, this exercise is gonna look like this. You're gonna go one, two, three, four, bring your feet together, hop up, grab your water bottle, over shoulder raise, step back, and we'll start again. One, two, three, four, hop up, over the head, shoulder raise, and go back. So it's a couple of movements with that. If you cannot do mountain climbers like this, all you can do is all you have to do is step. Actually, that works your core even more. You know what? So if you don't want to do the mountain climbers in my, at, at the rate I'm doing them, do steps. They work your core just as well. And you'll come up, you do four, hop up, grab that bottle, take it over your head. All right? So that's our first exercise. Second one, grab two of your water bottles. It's going to work our abs off. So... Grab your bottles, feet, take them up over your head, you're going to come up, back down, up, punches, we'll do 10 of those, alright, so we'll do 10 of those, then we're going to finish out with the oblique twist, oblique twist, you only need one water bottle, alright, you can keep your feet, I want you to have your feet just like this, lean back at a 90 degree angle, Twist from side to side. See, I'm taking the bottle. And I'm letting it touch nice and slow. Your head should be facing forward. You know I'm looking at you, talking to you. This is how it's going to look. So that'll be one. Nice and slow so we can get that burn. I can get that cake off my side. And that those uh, adult beverages I was drinking this weekend. All right? So we're going to do 10 of those as well. So, everybody got it. So get your water, get it down in front of you. Do the best you can. Like I said, you can do the step on the mountain climbers. You can do the mountain climbers at a more, uh, you know, fast rate. Either way, come up, get that water bottle, go back down, step back. And we'll all go, we'll all go together, all right? So, we are ready. Let's get down in our plank position. Hold the plank. Hold the plank. Can't go until I say go. I know I'm making y'all pay for my sins this weekend. I'm sorry. All right, you're gonna have that right or left leg forward. Put on my count. We're gonna take off and do it. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. One, two, three, four. Up. Step back. One, two, three, four. Hop up. Step back. One, two, three. Four. It's three. That's how many these we're gonna do. I didn't do that. One, two, three, four. 
Let's go for one more. Step back. One, two, three, four. It's five. Good job, everybody. All right. Grab those two water bottles for the second exercise. Excuse me. We'll be our sit up. On my count, get ready. Hold those water bottles right at your side. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Two. Three, control yourself. Going back. I'm gonna work those oblique, I mean, abdominal muscles. Four, at all times. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, two more. Nine. One more. Ten. All right, come up. One water bottle. Knees are bent. Lean back. 90 degree angle. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. That's two. That's four. Six. Nice and slow. There's eight. There's ten. All right, good job. That was ten. Guess what? We're gonna do it again. All right, get that bottle out in front of you. Get in that plank position. Don't go until I say the whistle blows. Hold that plank. Hold that plank. Hold that plank. Leg forward. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. One. Step back. Step back. Step back. Step back, one more. Step back, go back down into the plank. Nine, eight. Good job. All right, grab those two water bottles. Let's get on to our second set of abdominal sit ups. Water ball to the side. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Whew. I can feel that cape. That dope beverage, too. Two more. Woo. All right, sit up. Let's work your shoulders as well. See, I told you, even with that water bottle, you're doing a lot of it doing with your workout. After a while, it starts to, you can feel it. I mean, I only weigh a couple of ounces, but it works really good. All right, take that water bottle. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun, nice and slow. Two, it's four, woo, six, it's eight, two more, it's ten, good job everybody, we got one more set, I'm too old to be doing this stuff, but I gotta do it. I love to eat. I'll show you how to work out. I just can't tell you how to diet. That is not my forte. All right, we got one more set of these. Now I think we'll be done, all right? So get back in that plank position. This time when you're in the plank, 
I want you to be on your elbows. Sit up, up high. So let's go. One, two, three, six, seven. Now I want you to come to the push-up position. All right. Leg forward. Three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Grab that ball, step back. Let's go. Good job, everybody. Almost missed it that time. That's it. See the step. I'm gonna really make y'all hurt. Plank position, let's go. Seven. Oh yeah, that upper body should be hurting a little bit. Good job, good job, hanging. We almost done. Let's grab those two, and our last set. Of these sit-ups and obliques. All right, three, two, one. Let's have some fun. Go. Nice and slow coming down. Engage that core. Tell me you want some more. It's four. Five. Five more. Woo! I can feel it easy. Two more. Nine, one more. Ten. All right. Last set of the obliques. Grab that bottle. Place it to the side. Three, two, one. Let's finish out with some fun. Two. Four. Six, eight, two more, ten, guess what everybody, that was it, that was our workout, but as always, or every now and then, I want to throw a bonus challenge exercise into you, this is good for your hips and your obliques, alright, so, I just call them hip touches. I know they have some fancy technical name for them that I don't know that I probably should know, but I'm just gonna call them hip touches. All right, so what they look like is this. You can gain your forearms, just like you do with a plank. All right, feet shoulder, feet shoulder width apart. And you're just going out like this. Touch it from side to side. Really good for your hips and your obliques. So if you got it, you might adjust your feet every now and then. All right, so add those to your regimen, all right? So let's do a little stretching. I'll be down here on the floor. Feet together, we'll be out to the side. All right, butterflies. What you wanna do, the goal eventually is to have these legs touch down on the ground. I've been trying for years, just not that flexible. I need to stretch more, especially when I'm getting older. You don't want to bounce. Bouncing, you to strain everything on the inside of your hamstring. So, it's down to people just to sit like this. If you want an extra challenge, what you can do is lean, take your hands and press them on the outside of your shoes and lean really more over into it and try to press those legs down towards the ground you really 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 feel that stretch all right now we're gonna do next just gonna take our feet place them straight out in front of us bend over at the waist and just pull forward keeping those legs down engaged with the ground let's go far forward as you can working the back 
glutes, hammies. All right, good job, good job, everybody. That's it for the day. Listen, once again, I want to thank everybody for giving me a shout out for my birthday this weekend. Really, really, really appreciate it. Um, you know, hey, life is very precious as we know, as we can see right now. So I'm hoping and praying that everybody's staying engaged with their family. Um, really, really um, spending some quality time, um, not getting out unless you absolutely necessarily have to. Whatever you need, uh, a lot of us are blessed to be able to work remotely from home and praying for those who um, lost their jobs right now due to this situation. Um, hopefully, there's a, there's a, we're going to come out on the other side. We always do, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, just get your little feel of what you need to do off the TV and, and be done with it for the day. Because there's nothing you can really do about that. Just get the latest updates or whatever you need to do. And, um, oh, you're welcome, Miss Debbie. And, um... And from there, man, just go on, go on about your day. Get out every now and then if you want to. Go for a walk. Try to go in an area where there's not a lot of foot traffic. I go out and go for a walk. I have to. I got to get out the house. I, I'm going to stir crazy. Um, so to do those things. And, you know, hopefully this this will be, by, be over with soon. We can all get back together and conjugate. I'm still not going to come within six feet of none of y'all, you know. I'm still going to be giving y'all a shout out. From a distance or an elbow bump or something for a little while until I know it's all all the way clear. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to catch no residuals, something they come back and say something like, oh, we thought of it something. I don't know. Anyway, enough of me yapping, enough of me talking. I hope you enjoyed the workouts. I try to come on at about 12 noon every day. It may change just according to um, what well, my work schedule looks like. But you'll know. Those who will tune in, you'll see it on Facebook. And um, if you have anything that you uh, want me to work on a specific area, area I can definitely incorporate and include it in the workout. Um, I try to make sure that also too that um, if there's like issues, knee issues, and stuff, I try to show you a modified way of doing the exercises. So I hope that helps as well. Once again, please, please like, comment, please share these videos with whomever uh, that you think they might benefit. And also, please go to my YouTube channel, get fit with Flip, and subscribe. I'm going to start posting more ex ex daily exercises on there and these workouts as well. So, until then, I appreciate your support and take care.